We're in Savannah. We um, are stopping for dinner. I'm looking at the wrong thing. I'm looking at you. I really wanted some Korean food. I don't know. I was just in the mood for Korean barbecue. And so Kyle found this place that has really good reviews. It has yeah. like a little burner and everything. So we're going to get the real yeah, Korean the barbecue experience. We got um, to my dad's place kind of late last night. Um, we had a little catch-up sesh, and then I introduced Kyle and my dad to each other, and it was awesome. And now Kyle and I are downtown, and we're just gonna go go swarming. We're gonna eat first. It's a good job. Um, where are we going? This one? It's probably my job to tell you. Oh yeah. Kyle's our little navigator because he's the best vacationer, he deemed himself. So yeah, we're gonna go eat at this place called East Bay Meeting House for some breakfast. Catch you in the bedroom and you set the world on fire, but I side of your cocoon. It's like I'm just another guy because you're so preoccupied. Why you think that strange is gonna mind? If you come a little closer, forget about your suitcase, babe. Cause you know when we're older, we're gonna laugh about today. We're at the Gibbs Museum. Gibby. I swear he's really excited about me. I can't yell in here. <laughs> um, getting some art in. Big fans of art. Big art guys. We do see a lot of art. We see a lot of art. We like art. Yeah, we do like art. But right now we're sitting down because it's hot out and our feet hurt. to sustain me because I get so crazy worried that you'll go and replace me so show me with an action that on the train you won't get plastered and hook up with some model slash actor in the bathroom all that I need is confirmation of making a scene in the station before they call tell the children to look away you'll be on the train which is my favorite beach um, in Charleston, Mount Pleasant area. I'm so excited, except it's super hot today, even though we came out at like... It's 10. Yeah, yeah it's like 10, so I guess it's not as early as we intended, but yay! The little thing that I do, damn it, I'm feeling so cool, cool, cool. yeah. Woke up feeling like a new James Dean. Comb my hair like an old school scene. I'm feeling high like a late night summer in last year. Yeah. Standing there with the red dress on ya. I kill a queen like a young Jane Fonda. It isn't me or am I just having a good year? Let the other feelings go. So we had a really, it was a really great day actually. Um, yeah, so earlier we went to the beach um, and I got stung by a jellyfish. <laughs> so that was really fun. But we saw a dolphin. We did, we did three. saw three, we, we, yeah, we saw three dolphins. We saw dolphins. the tops of three dolphins. Yeah, they were like hunting. And then we saw a bunch of pelicans diving in the water. Um, so that was really nice. Um, but yeah, got stung by a jellyfish. Kyle was my savior, went and got some vinegar. 
um, from the store nearby. And then, like, while I was sitting there, like, heard, like, four other people say that they got stung by a jellyfish, so. It's jellyfish season. Apparently. Yeah, we had a family dinner, which was really nice because I hadn't seen my stepbrother in a super long time, like a couple years, and this was the first time that all of us were together um, since Cooper was born, which is my nephew, who is a year and a half year, a year and a half years old. How do you say that? One and a half years. He's old. a year and a half. Um, <laughs> one and a half. <laughs> well, it's not multiple years. It's one and a half years old. One and a half year. Yeah. I don't know. No, anyway. One and a half years. We went. <laughs> anyway. It doesn't sound right because it's one. No, because you go from one from one year to one point one years. Yeah, I guess. Um, but yeah, so that was really nice. We went to this Thai place and like ate our weight in food. Still feel like, awful. Not we... eating tomorrow. Yeah. No, I'm actually kind of like I could eat something right now. Oh my god, I would die. Yeah. And we just finished watching the Black Panther with my dad. I had never seen it before, so I loved it. Okay. See y'all tomorrow. Good night. We are about to go to Patriots Point with my dad. Um, there's just a bunch of history there, and um. You get access to a bunch of ships and museums and all that stuff. So Kyle is super into American history and so I'm super excited to take him here. I've actually never been. I've done, um, I went to Fort Sumter with my dad last time I was in town, um, but we didn't get to go to um, Patriots Point and do all the museums and all that stuff. So it should be fun. We're back in downtown Charleston. We are about to go eat some dinner, craving some seafood tonight. I am obsessed with oysters um, and Kyle wants some crab, so go and go to uh, this place called Darling Oyster Bar, is that right? Yeah, get it all. So I vlogged zero things yesterday, but gist of it, we went to brunch at this place called Junction. Food was really good, service was not, and the wait was ridiculous. Like the wait to get our food, like we were at the table and it took us like an hour to get our food. It was dumb because it's not a big place, but the food was really good and we ate every single bite of it. Um, and then after that, um, my aunt Carla, she threw a little shindig, um, and Kyle got to meet almost the entire, um, like my dad's side of the family, which was super nice. Um, and it went really well. I vlogged zero, zero, um, but it was really good and the food was really good and we, um, got leftovers 
and ate that today. And then last night we just stayed in, packed our stuff, because um, we're leaving today for Seattle. And uh, we watched a movie with my dad. It was uh, Skyscraper, right? Yeah, it had The Rock. Skyscraper the with rock The Rock. Is an architect. Architect, or architect guy. It was great. It was really good. Um, but now it's our last day in Charleston, and we are about to go see a movie. We're gonna go see Eighth Grade, and then I'm gonna give Kyle a little driving tour of Charleston before, or Mount Pleasant rather, before we hit, or catch a flight. We're not hitting the road this time. All right, so Eighth Grade, cringy. I was cringing the whole time. Emotional roller coaster. It really was. Oh my gosh. Tiffany I identified just identified way too closely with that movie. I did. I will never watch it again because it was I don't want to say it was too close to home because I wasn't that awkward and I was like it wasn't like that bad for me, oh, but it was, it was like an amplification of what everybody's felt before. Though. Exactly. Exactly, and it just like brought it brought too many things um, back, and I there were parts of it where I just couldn't watch, and then I felt like a parent to her because I just wanted her to be happy <laughs> and succeed and just make friends, and yeah, but I will never watch that again because it was too real. But Kyle loved it. it was great, maybe the year. Yeah, so should have gone to see Christopher Robin. So I gave Kyle a little mini tour of Mount Pleasant. Um, and by mini, I mean I showed him where I went to middle school and where I went to high school for a semester and where I had my first job, which was at Publix. And my first kiss. And my first kiss <laughs> in the stairwell of Publix. Um, but now we are at the Charleston Airport, about to get on a flight to Seattle. I'm so excited. Yeah. Crossing another state off my list. I've never been to Seattle, and it's exciting because we're going coast to coast, Atlantic to Pacific. So, and I get to see Dan tomorrow and hang out with Kyle's sister and fam, so. Lots of adventures to happen. Made it on the plane. It's like a almost six hour flight. But apparently we get some free Wi-Fi movies. So see y'all in Seattle. <laughs>